Hi, good morning. Uh, today in Singapore Math, we are going to take up a grade 4 problem and the topic we are going to deal is whole numbers. The specific type of problem is equal quantities at the end. Let's see what this means. So the question is, James had a total of 260 apples and oranges in his shop. So this 260 is inclusive of apples and oranges. After he sold half of the apples, we have no idea how many apples he had, but he had sold half of the apples and 80 oranges. He had an equal number of apples and oranges left. How many oranges did he have at his shop at first? See, at the beginning, we know that there are apples and oranges together is 260, but we have no idea how, how are they related. But after he sold half of the apples and 80 oranges, something he has done, he has an equal number of apples and oranges left. So we know what is at the end because there is a reference. So we start from the end. He had an equal number of apples and oranges left. We start from there. And because they are equal numbers, we could draw boxes of the same size for both apples and oranges. Now what we need to do is we have to go back and see what happened before this. See after he sold half of the apples, so as far as apples are concerned, he sold half of the apples. What is remaining is the other half. So before he sold, he would have had another half so he would have had this one whole, right? Half plus another half, which he had sold. And for oranges, this is what he has after he sold 80 oranges. So before that, he would have had another 80 oranges. So this whole thing was what he had at first. And the total of this was 260. So the total you see here is 260 and we know that this box, this box and this box, they are all of the same size. So if I consider this as one unit, the others are also one unit. So what I have now here is three units plus 80 gives me 260. And if I want to just remove this 80 on this side, I will also have to remove an 80 this side because this whole thing is equal to 260. So if I remove the 80 here, I'll have to subtract 80 from this 260. So three units is equal to 260 minus 80, which is 180. And as you know, one unit is equal to 180 divided by three, which is... Now let's look at how many oranges did he have at his shop at first. So oranges, as we know here, is one unit plus 80. That was what he had at first. So 60 plus 80, which is 140. So if you want to find out the number of apples he had at first, it's quite simple. He had two units, so each unit is 60, so two units is equal to 120. So that's the end of this uh, problem. It's a quite simple problem. If you have any questions or queries, please update in the comment section. And if you have any uh, feedback, do uh, feel free to update in the comment section. I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Have a great day. Bye-bye.